This contains strong language, sexual scenes and references from the beginning and throughout. Hi, I'm Sophie Kasai and today I have Abby. Coming on to Geordie Shaw, what has changed? The last one that we did was I was a proper cast member. A lot changed because I was working in the call centre. Obviously, we left my job and I've literally just been trying to find my feet. So did you ever think that being on a show like Geordie Shaw would open up so many doors? Never, like it's, it's bad. I did a tour in Australia, which was amazing. I think it's more like that people actually like you. Like I'm like, God, like people are actually starting to like us. A lot changed from my first series. What's it been like, social media wise? I think the social media's grown a lot. I feel like people hadn't even seen me on TV. They didn't know who I was. I knew that there was so, people that have been in this house that were loved by everyone. Yeah. It was hard for people to see new people coming in when they've loved other people in this house so much. So I, yeah. I found that a bit of a struggle. When the whole like makeup thing came out, like I didn't want to leave my house. What was the makeup thing? So it was in my first series and didn't have a clue about makeup, didn't have a clue about anything. And then I remember I didn't tan my face. So I had this old brown body and pale face. And I woke up the next day and it was literally in every single paper online even people that I know tagging me in it and taking the mic and I remember I was in my room and I just cried and I didn't want to leave the house. Like there's worse things going on in the world and I think like coming into a show at 19 is so young and of course yeah. we don't all know about makeup. I'm not a bad, like I'm not a bad person, do you know what I mean? Why, why am I getting all this? What have I done to deserve all of this? I did get so much hate and so much trouble but I did get a few messages of girls that go like look like Everyone's done it, you're not on your own, which was nice. So do you think that it changed you in any way, like physically or like your appearance? It's hard because I don't want to change myself and regret doing stuff, so I think you've just got to try and find that balance. Do you feel like now that you're on this massive TV show, do you find it hard to meet lads now and like maybe go on dates or find a relationship? I do find it a lot harder. But I feel like the, the place that I'm, I am in my life right now, it's I'm focusing on me and focusing on on this now in my career. And if it comes along, it comes along. This is a new life and you, you're going to be able to have so many opportunities. What in an ideal world would you want to do? My ideal world in the future, I would love to branch out of clothing. I love fashion. Like if I had my last 20 pounds, I would buy clothing. There's nothing more I love than going out in a dead nice glam dress if I had the opportunity to branch out in that in fashion. I think Abs, you're a breath of fresh air. You've got a very, very good future ahead of you. Oh, thanks Sophie. I feel like I've had a th therapy session. Now go and get fucking pissed. <laughs>